Hello, um, I'm Rona Hussein. I'm the director of Hopkinton Public Library, and here with me is uh, Heather Backman. She is the Adult Services Librarian, and we have finally uh, relocated the library to 65 South Street, um, Suite 104. Uh, our move uh, has been complete. We're actually ready to ready to go. Uh, our expected opening date, we hope, um, to be day after the Martin Luther King's uh, holiday, which is April 19th. Um, we are very excited to welcome our community to our new space. Uh, it's slightly smaller than what we had, but um, I think it's nice to lay out because um, we have different sections. So actually we have more space for people to use some quiet space or maybe small group discussion or meetings and whatnot. So we are very, very excited. Um, Heather, do you want to talk about what we have? Sure, yeah. The hours to mention. Absolutely, hours, yeah. Yeah, right? we will be open uh, the same hours that we were open prior to moving. So that's uh, 10 to 5 on Monday, uh, sorry, 10 to 5 on Tuesday, Thursday, and 10 to 8 on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and 10 to 4 on Saturdays. Uh, we've brought about 40% of our collection with us, uh, so there's plenty to check out. We've got DVDs, audiobooks, books, we've got plenty of children's and teen things. Uh, we brought our magazines with us and we will still be getting newspapers. So we've got basically everything you used to come to the library for, just a little bit less of it at the moment. But we brought all of our newest things um, and we're still ordering, we're still getting things in, so there's lots to check out and we hope you'll come down and join us soon. Yeah, and it will be borrowed too. Anything yeah. that we put on storage and um, interlibrary loan, as you know, it's, it's fairly quick. It works really yeah. well, so you can borrow here too. So this is our circulation area. We brought the desk with us, which was an experience for the poor movers. Um, and then this is what we've got for our sort of general public space. We did bring two of our public computers uh, for adults with us. Um, into the public space. So that will be um, hopefully something people can continue to use. People really like our computers. And here's what we have for the adult collections. Uh, like I said, we have DVDs and audiobooks and fiction, nonfiction, new stuff. Uh, we just started placing orders again, so there should be new things in by the time we reopen, hopefully. We've got a copy room. We've got actually a small chair to work in in the copy room. We're able to bring our archival materials with us and um, actually because of we've been able to fit them in in an accessible way we'll be able to make them accessible to the public as they were before uh, talking to me or to Linda Connolly who's our archivist about uh, getting in and seeing our archival materials so that's really exciting because we weren't sure we would have any of this available in the temporary space but we do. We have an entirely separate periodicals room so all of our magazines and um, Newspapers and actually also our reference collection are going to be in here. <laughs> this is where we receive orders and process materials and pay bills and anything else administrative that needs to be done. This is our book sale area where we um, sell books for um, a small price and someone can come here and use their laptop and work quietly. So this is the most exciting part, I think, because we never had, this is the, this is a room for young adult, and we did not have this space before, so we're very pleased to be able to create this space for young adults. So we separated their collection, and we are hoping to hire a professional librarian to serve the teens of our community. So uh, we would definitely like them to come and use it and make a recommendation on in our collections and stuff. So we're quite excited about this space. And then I'm going to take you to the children's room. We're really excited to welcome you to the new temporary children's room. Um, we've brought along a good selection of the books that you love and that you can still come and get here. And we hope to offer story time as well. We can use the room in young adult for that. And um, if you'd like to come through, we have our picture books. We also have in the children's room now the um, children's DVDs. Um, but picture books, fiction, audio books, mysteries, everything is still here for you. Um, 
and we've also brought some of our friends that you'll remember that are great favorites of the children up here all of our little friends from characters from different uh, children's books are here and uh, some of our posters we still have some decorating to do and a few other things for displays before we open Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs>